access. All access, the best. Keep watching. Mimi naitwa Joseph Kusaga, mkurugenzi wa Clouds Media Group. Yes, mambo vipi mambo vipi? I hope uko poa sana na kutazama Clouds TV. Kuna vitu vingi vingi sana ambavyo mara nyingi ukiniona unajua kabisa inakuwa ni exclusive. <laughs> That's it. Leo ni siku kubwa sana sana kwa Mwamvita Makamba ambaye mara nyingi sana tumekuwa tunamuona mitandaoni, tunamfahamu kutokana na familia. Lakini vile vile Mwamvita akatuletea kitu ambacho ni kikubwa sana. Tunajua sisi hatuna ile kawaida ya kusoma na nini lakini Mwamvita akasema no. Huko huko ambako tuna kawaida. Mimi enda kufanya kitu kikubwa sana guess what things i tell my daughter ndo kitabu ambacho mwanvita anatuletea and ladies and gentlemen niko nyumbani kwa mwanvita makamba and this is nadhani ndo daughter mwenye anazungumzia <laughs> hi malaika hi mambo vipi um <laughs> poa <laughs> uko fresh yeah niko fresh anything to tell uh, watu ambao wanatazama kuhusiana na mama um the book is a fantastic book mm -hmm. it explains everything that my mom has gone through and how she's raised me to become mm -hmm. who i am and who i will be in the future mm -hmm. and i feel like it inspires younger people to be better mm -hmm. and to focus on themselves and who they love and care about okay. do you think do, do you think you have anything important you can speak up and be here like i want to tell this and tell this about my mom's book um With my mom's book, um, you need to read it with an open mind. You need to focus on all the words that she says in the book because right. everything that she says in the book um, can guide you through everyday life because when it says in one of the pages, always thrive, don't just exist. Okay. So meaning that you have to always be in the moment, be who you are. Yeah. So in the book, you just need to realize that you have to be who you are. Okay. Through everything. I need to know about you. Anything do you like from your mom? Well, I like how hard working she is. Mm -hmm. I like who she is and how she's become throughout the years. Mm -hmm. And I like how how passionate she is through everything she does and okay. um just how loving she is as well. Mm -hmm. That's that's one of my favorite things about my mom. Anything <laughs> you fair about mom? <laughs> <laughs> um Sometimes she overworks herself mm -hmm. to try and give the best life that she can give me mm -hmm. and she forgets to take care of herself mm -hmm. because um she's trying to work so hard just to make our lives amazing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sasa, you're going to promise your mom tell her anything you want to tell her from your deepest part of your heart. Um I'm just so proud of her. Mm -hmm. And I'm so grateful that she's my mom okay. and I really love her mm -hmm. from the bottom of my heart. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Thank you so much Malaika. Huyu ni Malaika, Malaika mtoto wa Mwanvita Makamba na kitabu ambacho amekiandika it's about to come inspire lakini na vitu vingi sana ambavyo wazazi tukipitia hicho kitabu tutafahamu vingi sana. Thank you Asante sana for coming. Girl. Thank you so much. You look good. Thank you. Jackson kuna nilipenda ile. Wanini sasa tuka No. Thank you. Thank you for your blessing. Jamal leo tumemechisha naona green kidogo, you know, green kidogo. Tunajua tu. Kwa nini ukutambia theme? How many to Macy? Nadhani tumehisi. Sio kitabu kina green green ile. Nice. Sijaenda mbali sana jamani. Na heshima details. How are you lucky? I'm fine. Nashukuru kabisa. Alhamdulillah. Na Malika bifuata sijaomba ruksa yako nikaanza kuongea naye <laughs> nimependa confidence yake nimependa anavyojifunza vizuri kutoka kwa nashukuru tuna kawaida mm -hmm. kwanza hongera asante hongera sana asante wajisi tuna kawaida tunasema wabongo watupende kusoma mm -hmm. hatuna kwa ka utaratibu mm -hmm. confidence ukaitoa wapi ukasema hata msichokipenda mimi inakuja huko unajua kitabu hicho kiandika hata style yake ni kumruhusu kila mtu aweze kusoma mm -hmm. mara nyingi hata mimi mwenyewe napenda kusoma mm -hmm. lakini vitabu vingi ni vizito lazima ujipange unasoma kitabu kimoja kwa miezi miwili lakini kwa vile nilikuwa na maudhui ambayo nilikuwa nataka haraka haraka yawafikie wazazi na watoto kwa kitabu changu style yake ni maudhui mafupi kwa ni mistari mmoja paragraphs katika kila page kiingereza na Kiswahili pamoja ili wa rahisi kwa kila mtu kusoma na kitabu hiki sio tu kwamba unasoma unaacha ni kile kitabu ambacho ukijisikia uko chini unakifata kinakunyanyua unakiweka pembeni ya kitanda chako kama hujalala ukitaka motivation unakisoma 
kama ni wasichana wanataka kushare na wenzao wanasoma pamoja. Kwa hivyo ni kitabu cha kama mfumo wa maisha. Unakuwa unaendelea kila siku kukisoma na kukisoma na kukisoma kwa sababu maudhui lazima tujifunze kila siku. Unajua uwezo kusema ni sasa nimeshakariri mimi ni mtu perfect. Lazima kila siku urudi kujifunza. Kwa kitabu hichi ni style hiyo. Ni rahisi sana kusoma. Jamani hata kikuongea vitu vingi sana kwa sababu hapa ni nyumbani na tutaelekea sehemu ya venue ambako tutaenda kuzindua rasmi kitabu chetu. Sasa tutarajie nini huko tunakwenda maana mimi jamani huwa nafenda kuuliza haya maswali. <laughs> Tofauti eh. Mm-hmm. Wewe twende. <laughs> Let's go guys. Tuka enjoy pamoja na kumsupport Mwangita Makamba ni hatua kubwa sana kuelezea kitu. Unajua mna kitu kizuri kama kuelezea kitu ambacho ndo unachokihishi. Yaani ndo maisha yako. So guys, let's go tukajifunze tupate kitu kipya kutoka kwa Mwangita Makamba. Mimi naitwa Ziza. Ziza na access zake and this is Clouds TV. Pewa kazi mbili uh, kwanza kuwakaribisha lakini pili kuwashukuru na uh, napenda kukaribisha wote kwenye uzinduzi wa kitabu hiki cha Mwavita uh, na pia napenda kuwashukuru uh, kwa kukubali mwaliko uh, wa Mwavita kuja kuhudhuria na kushuhudia uzinduzi huu kwa kweli kwa kukubali mwaliko huu nampa heshima kubwa Mwavita Nimeipa hii shughuli mzito na heshima kubwa. Kwa tunashukuru sana. Asanteni sana. Kwanza ni mpongeze uh, kwa jambo hili. We're very proud of you. Ongera kwa kuwa mwandishi wa kitabu. Na ongera pia kwa kumlea malaika. Mara ya kwanza mwanvitu aliponiambia kwamba anataka uh, kuandika kitabu Uh, nikao skeptiko ndio uh, kama kawaida yangu kwa vita na mipango mingi sana kwa hiyo sikumkatisha tamaa nikampa moyo nikamwambia hamna shida you can do it uh, kitakuwa kizuri andika lakini nikao sina hakika kama nitaisha <laughs> na kama tutafika siku ya leo sasa baada ya muda akanitumia manuscript kwamba amemaliza kitabu. Nikao skeptical zaidi. Kwa sababu kitabu kwanza kilikuwa chembamba. Alafu pili, uh, maneno yaliyokuwa kwenye kitabu yalikuwa ni ya kawaida sana. Na kupenda mwanangu. Very simple. Na kama mpita mbona hamna insight ya. Hiki kitabu cha namna gani? Uh, lakini ukitafakari kwa kina na wote tunawapenda watoto wetu lakini mara nyingi hatuwaambi na wakati mwingine kwa sababu hatuwaambi hawajui na kwa sababu wakati mwingine upendo wetu tunadhani tunauonyesha kwa vitendo vyetu kwa sababu ya kwa ada kwa kujia ngoro siku tunapeleka sinema lakini bado maneno na kuwakumbusha ya nguvu kwa imani yangu ni kwamba kitabu hiki kitakukumbusha wakati wote uh, nguvu ya maneno tunayoambia na watoto wetu. Sasa kuna utata lazima tutatue kidogo kwenye mstari wa kwanza kabisa wa utangulizi wake. Alisema baba mama mkali baba mpole sasa haja qualify ile sentence na qualification ni hii baba alikuwa mpole kwake kwa hiyo mle ndani asizungumzie wote <laughs> na na ila ni kweli uh, mama hapa alikuwa mkali kweli sasa sisi wengine ye yeah, alikipita kwa mama peke yake. Sisi tulikipita kwa baba na mama. Uh, kwa hiyo uh, Mwavita ni product ya tough love from the mother and soft love from the mother. Uh, na, yes, tough love from mother, soft love from the father. Uh, ndio imemtengeneza alivu. 
na nazungumza kwenye kitabu chake kwamba sasa bwana mlea malaika peke yake challenge ilikuwa ni combination ya tough love na soft love kwa yeye mzazi e, na nadhani mtaona katika kitabu na katika utangulizi namna ambavyo ana negotiate hilo uh, jambo All access. All access. The best. Keep watching. <laughs> Mimi naitwa Joseph Kusaga, mkurugenzi wa Clouds Media Group.